Hi Taurus, how are you doing? So we're having a look at the Shadow Escapes Tarot to help you empower yourself and self-help yourself. So let's have a look at the aspects of Taurus today. What does Taurus need to know today? And then we're going to use three cards of changing energies for Taurus. Okay. Then we're going to use the Moon Queen Oracle to have a further message. So the first aspect today is the Five of Cups. Five of Cups is perhaps one of the most um, not so good cards because it just means that we're still in our pain of the past, the disappointment and the disillusionment. But with anything, it's always good to assess what that pain is. So finding out that we no longer need that, it's not really serving us as greater as it could be. Now's the time to have a look at the newness, the new situation, and really understand that to do so, we have to get rid of that pain. The pain that's been there, we now let it go to understand, to cross over and, and embrace the new emotional aspect. There's always new love if we let go of the old love that hasn't worked. So these two little element spirits are reminding you that please pay attention to the moment, not the past. Otherwise it can swamp us and really keep us small and block our way to the newness. So the new life, the new money, the new relationship is all there waiting, but it won't align properly if we're still blocking it with the poison. So Taurians, you've got the Temperest. So this is very um, in keeping with this because it's the balance and the change that's happening within you. Notice it's all within you to create your emotional state and your mental state as well can really be affected if we're still concentrating and the flashes of thoughts come in to our mind to allow us to feel down. Now is the time to clear away the emotional hurt, to embrace the newness, create a vision of the future that you want fully now. So it's with balance and understanding and urging on to allow that to happen, especially in the new season. Out with the old and in with the new. So have that balance, have that connection between action and non-doing. Really visualise that you are all going to concentrate perhaps on the newness and the fulfilment of your heart. Moving on, the Page of Cups. So a newness, an exciting time to understand that it's really fantastic, the opportunities that await. So it does seem that you've cleared away the oldness and embracing the newness. This uh, mermaid, she's got some lovely scents going on. So aromatherapy, holistic, and, and putting the fire back. Drinking from the cup of life, the cup of love. This mermaid knows that. So it's with newness that you can accept all things from the heart. Find the deep love that is the connection of all things and maybe tap into your intuition if you can do that to enhance the feeling of goodness and creativity. So the changing aspects that are going on in your life is a Knight of Pentacles. 
Seeing the future is essential now. And the sleeping dragon is there. And it is ready to take effect. To move very, very fast when needed to into your vision. They can go very, very deep and very, very far. This pentacles is all about how you practically move through your life. So it's with a set it's with a sense of um direct and also a almost sting in the tail. But it's like you have to move forward at some stage with these dreams and aspirations. So follow your heart now with the Page of Cups and take action when everything is more clearer to yourself. And you put this emotional hurt behind. Six of Cups. This is a lovely time to nostalgically think about what it was like to play as a child. To feel that fun and that belief. This child is playing tea parties and she believes that her toys are people in this tea party. So this is all about the, the change. Bring life, lots of life to you. When things seem a little bit not in a movement aspect, Take the Knight of Pentacles, see your vision, manifest it, put life into it and know it's with abundance that you do this. It's the wonderment, it's self-love and self-belief. But look at the reality of the situation and really make things happen, especially here with the page of um, cups. It's all about your heart, all about self-belief now. Six of Swords, this is a lovely time to transform all those negative thoughts into positive and just fly away to a new place in your mind, in your dreams, in your visions, because some things do no longer serve. This is why the balance is there. This is why it's a reminder that the Five of Cups, the poison of the past, has to be let go of. So allow yourself to be transformed with your heart, transformed when you see that future. Have patience with being transformed because sometimes change can be scary. And that's why you have the temperance here to remind you that things are changing for the better. So let's have a look at the Queen Moon Oracle just to see your further message. So for, for yourself, it's assessing. So this is obviously um, what's going on here. Putting away the old, assessing the future. The Knight of Pentacles is a slow movement towards the future. We can't move towards it if we don't see what is going on. So really feel. This is about feeling your reading. Feel what you want for your future. And then see it as new and safe. Put behind you what needs to be put behind you. And grasp the newness, especially regarding love. So it's with that, guys. I wish you all the love in the world. And thank you very much for listening and watching. And we'll see you again soon.